Welcome back! So, let's get started. What do I need to do? Go to Shell Bay 10 using the Turbo Lift. Alright, let's begin our stealth mission. We have to sneak in, get materials, get out. Oh, you guys. Oh, I'm serious, man. Vulcans love it when you yank real hard on their ears. Some Vulcan pain ritual thing. Really? No. Yeah. How do you think they got so pointy? Trust me, try it. Tuvok will have an all new respect for you. I don't know. much action yeah we must be the second string hazard team fine by me who knows what they'll find over there ah uh, we handled those scavengers pretty well last time i'm sure they won't have any problem oh god you jinxed it on the bright side i should be really good at poker by the time we get back to earth let me see you got Oh, oh dear. Oh, oh god. Okay, oh, wait, one second. I think I got this. Alright, you got what looks like a shack? No, a king? A ten? Uh, ace? And I don't know what that one is. <laughs> Alright. Nope, okay. Other turbo lift. Woo. All right. Deck 10, shuttle bay. Time to start that mission. Go to shuttle bay. Lieutenant Foster is waiting for me. some trouble with the docking clamps, but I think Salma and Lang are on it. Alright. Delta High Hair. So what's with that base? Looks like a scrap. Looks like it was thrown together from the remains of their ships, I'd guess. Yeah, I thought I saw a cavort class bird of prey in there. Yeah, Klingons. Yeah, what's with that anyway? I mean, are we allies with the Klingons? I heard Chakotay saying they didn't answer hails, but maybe they have no comm system. Anyway, they attacked us, so they must be hostile. Yeah, who knows how long they've been here. They might not even know we're allies. Right. That's just an insta-kill. Oh, hey, there's something fun you should see. I'm going to technically lose the game again, but watch this. Let me save it. I figured this out last time. I'm going to save over stealth. Yes. Alright. This person here... And this is it. I learned that from accidentally killing someone. It's unfortunate you chose this course of action. I'd respected you as an officer and found working with you enlightening. Goodbye, Monroe.
Yeah. And now, I'm back. Yeah. So, you can do it, but something else happened last time I did it. I spawned in a different location with a tricorder. Dave and Ro, they're waiting for you down below. They're having some trouble with you. Sir? Sir. What is it, Ensign? I'll try it again. I've already tried it five times. They're stuck. Controls must have been damaged when we tried. Great. Lang to Paris. I'm down below, but there's a serious exhaust leak down here. I can't get to the overrides. Hey, Les, can you send one of your men down there? If we can't get those docking clamps released, we'll be going nowhere fast. Sure. Monroe, you don't look busy. Get down below and see what you can do. Yes, sir. So what's with that base? All right, just trigger the conversation. Let's go. You know, I didn't think that was going to happen. I see a vent there. I'm going to try and find the entrance to that vent. Oh. Sorry, man, it was too late. You did it. Good work, Monroe. Good. Get back up here, Monroe. Let's get this show on the road. Yes, sir. Tom Paris at your service. I will be your captain for this flight. I estimate a cruising speed of about two thirds impulse power and an elapsed time of just under five minutes. All right, Captain. We're all set here. Okay, all aboard. This is your captain speaking. The in-flight movie will be Captain Proton versus the Robo Zombies. Oh, I'd watch that. Thank you for flying Delta Flyer Airlines, and we hope you have a pleasant flight. Also, I adjusted the sound balancing and OBS. Hopefully, the game's not too quiet now, but I noticed it was extremely loud. Because uh, it was a new source, and blah, blah, blah. I never actually... <laughs> It's just a mumble jumble of a bunch of ship parts. There's the Klingon ship for the prey. There's a bunch of other things too. This is definitely space, not a giant cube. Good luck, gents. Meet you back at the homestead. All right. This is a stealth mission. Avoid detection at all cost. However. Find yourself in a hostile engagement. Defend yourself by any means necessary. On route to airlock three. Right, on my way to airlock two. I guess I'm on my way to airlock one. Yeah, who knew space was just a giant cube? Have fun on saying that. Old game. Delcia checking in. I'm in position. Odell checking in. I'm through the third airlock. All right, team. We'll be using a coded Federation subspace comm channel, but try to maintain comm silence unless absolutely necessary. When I give the signal, return here. We'll have pattern enhancers set up to beam us out. All right, let's go. Let's see if I'm any good at stealth in this game. Okay, Monroe. We'll be able to track you for a little while here. We'll try to alert you to any dangers we can detect. Thank you. Alright, let's read. I have to infiltrate the Klingon vessel and obtain three samples of ISD... I... 
Aizdesium. Aizdesium may be scattered throughout the area and even be used in scav by the scavengers. Walking or crouching while walking helps make less noise. Stick the shadows to minimize your chance of being seen. Leaning around corners is a good tactic. Second, what is the lean button before I even try? Lean left, lean right. Where's lean? Nope, that's turn. Back pedal, step left, step right. Slice it, turn. Up, down, crouch. Quick keys, no attack. Look. feel like a ninja. <gasps> Odell checking in, sir. Go ahead. I found some isodesium. This section looks male in design. Run down, lots of fog. Radiation levels are high. Roger. Foster up. yellow does that mean we're about to do something called save scumming don't know what that is um you're about to learn okay that did work all right if i see yellow it means i can interact with it Okay, no manner. Okay. Am 
Might as well top it off. Okay, okay. I take it no. I can attack this door though. It's saying I can. Okay. It's interactable, but not that interactable. Could knock him out. But I don't. I only got gun. That might be what I need right there. It's on the ground. Wait for him to walk by. I'm gonna check that out. And if it's not actually while he's doing that, let me actually check this way. Ah, this human food tastes like nope. That was a no. Just an absolute no. I, that might be something I need. Once again, save scum. Back in the day before toggle crouch was a thing. Nope. I'm going up the ladder. I'm not going through the mess hall where all the Klingons are eating our food. That seems like a bad idea. Come on, go. Telsia checking in, sir. Go ahead. I found a sample of the Isodesium. Sir, this area looks like a Federation ship. Early 23rd century. These markings. This is not an archaeological expedition. Just get the samples and get out. Roger, sir. Telsia out. That is why humans like it. Well, it was a good raid. Raids. We are Klingons, not Orion pirates. There is no honor in raids. And we have to put up with those insufferable Melon Patoks. And those irritating humans. At least they're a good buffer from erosion. Buffer? Now you sound like a Romulan. They're lucky we need them for raids. If we ever get out of here, the first ones I plan to kill are those Herojin. <laughs> that would be a glorious battle. It will be a good day to die. Are you not going to come more? For the weapon. Broken. Absolutely not. I'm going back. So I think I can grab that. I have to be able to grab that. I mean, it's just right there. Because that door's red, and that door's red. Okay. 
All right, looks like the hallways are clear. Still red. Trying to avoid that. Excellent. Monroe, what's your status? Just found my first sample, sir. Roger. Foster out. I'm gonna have to be very careful because I I think this can go south really fast. Alright, that guy I had to kill because I accidentally trigger him. Luckily no one heard it. screams of when they you baser them and they're just ripped apart by the molecular level. It's harsh. I have a feeling that door is gonna open and it's gonna cause me I should avoid the water, shouldn't I? Oh my god. Odell? What is it? I don't know. Bones? Oh wait. I think I'm being followed. I'll check in later. Odell out. transfer power away from this quadrant? Monroe, Ken here. You're in the Klingon engineering section. There should be a power transfer console on the top level. Roger, I'm on it. What does it look like? Uh, you'll know it when you see it. Oh, okay. Come on. Alright, we need one more sample. I need to reroute the power. Oh, that might be it. That did it. Thanks, Monroe. Monroe, what's going on now? You're supposed to avoid the detection. Sorry, sir. Just get the isotesium and get back here. I mean, this isn't the first time I was detected. Don't know what kept you so long for saying I got detected. Now you won't have to see each other's repugnant faces. <laughs> We're not leaving until you return power to our sector. This Patak must be hallucinating. I know what that word means. And what are you going to do about it? We outnumber you two to one. Ha! 
It would take 20 Melon to equal one Klingon warrior. It is we who outnumber you two to one. That would be ten to one, Klingon wench. Stop. They might be telling the truth. Let's check it out. We're not leaving until you restore power. Fine. Be on. On Roe to Foster, I have the last sample of Isodesium. I'm on my way back. Hold on, Monroe. Odell hasn't reported back yet. We can't get any response from him. Can you go check it out? Yeah. I'm right by the entrance to the Malon area. Good. See if you can find Odell. But be careful. Foster out. All right, now I gotta find Odell. Monroe to Ken. There's a security door at the Malon entrance. Roger. I'll see if I can override it from here. Thanks, Ken. So, there are bugs down here. Alright, the steam doesn't hurt me, that's what I was worried about. This area sucks. Holy cow. I need to get all the way up there. Ooh. The ship's upside down. Oh, uh, never mind. No, it's not. I might be able to make that jump. Is that the jump it wants me to make? Oh, damn it. Oh, that's walk. God damn it. I forgot. Walk. Okay, here we go again. This way is not worth it. I'm going to try and do a jump. I'm already running. Get over here. Nope. No, okay. Why are you here? You are unnecessary. Look around. There's something here I'm not seeing. Be able to jump over there. Hmm. Oh.
Oh, never mind. I take it back. Now I understand the usefulness of the box. If I drop down in there, that's an insta kill easily. No, I'm not entering the new area yet. Now I'll enter the new area. I don't think they're coming. Those stupid paranoid erosion. They lock all the doors. How are we supposed to tell them? I guess they don't want anyone stealing their supplies. That wasn't us. Well, let's just keep waiting and see if they come. Come on, careful, careful, careful. We are very, very, very close. Where am I going? No, really, where am I going? There's nowhere to go over here. The door is locked. I think I gotta go on the pipe. I don't even think I was supposed to be able to do this. <sighs> yeah, that's it. Technically, I could shoot them right now and kill them. But my mission is to be stealthy, even if stealth already failed. Oh. energy. Ah, oh, hell. That's the... No, I'm doing good with the phaser right now. I don't need energy. Yeah, these are completely destroyed. The music's getting intense a little bit. Where is the alpha? He's on a hunt. Some fresh prey I hear. Uh oh. Careful. Are you standing there? Or are you gonna move? No. Must have been on the lookout for me or something. I needed that really badly. Over there. Yeah, I like this gun. I will top my health off, yes. 
No. Actually. No, it has nothing to do with that. There is something in here, but. Ah! Uh oh. Odell. Yes, sir. I was ambushed. A weapon. Communicator. Taken. Never saw them. Save your strength, Tom. I'll beam you out of here. Monroe to Foster. I found Odell. He's hurt bad. I'm beaming him back to the extraction point with his isodesium. Understood. Foster out. Monroe. Wait. I still have to get one more sample of the isodesium. Don't worry, Tom. I'll get it. Be careful. Ambush. Yeah, okay, aliens in the next area are alerted to use stealth tactics one more. gun rules that grenade launcher is awesome Monroe to Foster I found the last piece of isodesium there's a huge bay between us there's a system of some sort, but the control room is on the other side. Wait a second, Alex. I think I know where you are. I was just there. Hold on. Okay, I'm here. I see the controls. Give me just a second. She got captured. What's going on down there? telsey has been captured. I've got to rescue her. Of all the... All right, Monroe, but be careful. We can't afford to lose another man. If you can't rescue her, just get back here. Don't worry, sir. I'll get her. Monroe out. Odell's last sample there and then locate and rescue her which I will also I'm gonna change off that gun for now because that gun is amazing I love the grenade launcher all right stealth's not gonna work so I'm not gonna crouch anymore let's do it I think I'm doing pretty good. I could do phaser, but that's not gonna be any good now. Oh, you know, we'll use this. All right. Now, I'm gonna crouch just in case stealth does work, maybe. Hopefully. Oh, no.
Enemy, enemy. I have to go that way, don't I? Alright. second or the third friendly they are not i think crouching though does work here all right go away i know what to do all right the this is a starfleet ship i think swan's walking Funny. Okay. I won't be able to crawl on that. No. What was that? Sounded like those broken doors over there. I don't know. I guess we better check it out. When are those lazy techs going to fix this thing? Yeah, it's been like this for months. Well, if it were up to me, Spider would be in the agony booth for a week. Well, let's just jam it open. Yeah. Let's get some grub. Sure. Okay, where are you getting grub? I hear walking. Don't come this way. Oh, they're going that way. Sorry for really quiet, I'm just focusing right now. Stealth mission and all, I'm actually trying to stealth. Hey Spider, don't throw that crossover yet, you'll blow the converter. 
Yeah, yeah, Chris. I, I got it under control. Just a few more seconds. So they caught this woman trying to steal some of our isodesium. She had a whole bag full of it. What? Where did she come from? Yeah. Nobody knows. But Doc Krieg's got her down in sick bay for questioning. Okay, all set here. All right, I know where I have to go. Come on, Ren. Let's get back to that converter those crinkle heads gave us. Hey, Spider. If you need us for anything, just call it. Yeah. Crinkle heads. Can I go through here? No. All right. This way. Not there. This is where I'm looking for. Okay. Hoping that they come back and have some dialogue, but I think they're busy. All right, there's some insects. They sound adorable until you see them, and it's like that's a giant cockroach. All right, I killed it there, so we're going this way. the med bay. Oh, that's what... Okay. Feels like I'm playing Alien Isolation. All the oh, hey, what was that? I don't know. Guess we better check it out. <laughs> I don't know why they make us patrol all the time. It's not like the Malons would come back after what we did to them the last time. It's not the Malons the captain's worried about. It's those damned Klingons. <laughs> So lazy. 
Yeah? Well, you red shirts think you run this shit. Watch your mouth. Watch your back. Yeah, yeah. Telsey is being Intruder held. Alert. This area is swarming with scavengers. It's going to be impossible for me to get to her. Hit the Don't alarm. risk the mission, Monroe. If the odds are overwhelming, you're going to have to abort. Telsia knew what she was getting into. She wouldn't want you to get killed in some hopeless... Wait a second. I've got an idea. Monroe out. Well, I'm going to dress up as one of them. Very smart. Hello. I probably still shouldn't get caught by every person. Hey. You there. The prisoner is a bit stubborn. Get me some Veritrax 12 from the lab. It's the blue hypo spray. Okay. Will do, sir. Nope. Nope. Do you just... Ah, okay. I could truth serum her and act like I'm... Ooh, okay. I'm gonna do this. This is gonna be interesting. I'm gonna do what he asked me to. God damn it. All right. The only way back to the extraction point is through the control center, and it's sure to be guarded. All right, then you'll have to pretend to be my prisoner. Oh, come on, Monroe. That's the oldest one in the book. Any better suggestions? Okay, okay. Here, follow me. Put your gun away, for one. code for the door. Give me a second. Four of them. Be ready. Mm -hmm. Where are you taking her? She's my prisoner. Why did you bring her here? I never told anyone to... Wait. Who are you? Men, detain them both. <laughs> Oh, that's bad. Don't touch that. I love how she's like, what are you doing? We clearly had our cover blown. I was clearly. Stop. 
Yep, that happens. I have the passcode for the door. Give me a second. Four of them. Be ready. Where are you taking her? She's my prisoner. Why did you bring her here? I never told anyone to. Wait. Who are you? Men, detain them both. <laughs> That one better. All right, now we got a problem. Oh, there it is. Huh? Excellent. Do not step in front of me. I'm using a very dangerous gun. Okay. I don't think your prisoner trick is going to work this time. It didn't work the first time. I told you that was the oldest one in the book. Is that the only way back? The one and only. Okay, look, I've got an idea. I'll go out there and distract them. They shouldn't recognize me with this disguise on. At least not right away. While they're distracted, you sneak out. Take all the isodesium with you. But what if they realize you're not one of them? Are you sure that... I'll be fine. Trust me. Hey, Monroe. Last one there's a Denebian slime devil. Hey, what are you doing here? The captain sent me down to check things out. Really? I didn't hear anything from the captain about this. Oh, yeah. The communications are out. He sent me down here to tell you in person. Tell us what. Uh, that I'm coming? I don't think I've seen you before. Who? All hands, red alert. There's an intruder disguised as one of us with a woman. They killed the captain. Capture them at all costs. Oops. Kill him. Cover Surrender me. or die. <laughs> Oh wow, she flies. A lot of crystals. Oh, I was supposed to take the elevator? Well, whoops. Good thing I didn't. Are you coming back? I don't want to drop. Can you just come back? There. Yeah, that, that, of course I'd somehow do that. Let's go. Who's there? I am the hunter. Uh-oh. Boss? You are my prey. Is this a boss battle? Whoa, 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 wait, wait, wait a second. I have been tracking you since you entered our hunting grounds. Mm -hmm. Your performance has been exemplary. You shall make a challenging prey. Look, there's no need for this. Can't we just...
Okay, he's invulnerable. I can't hurt him. In other words, grenade launcher time. Does the most damage. Okay, what are we gonna do? That's good. Can I have your gun after? Does this guy do anything else? <laughs> Guess not. One second, I got a text message that I should answer. There we go. Yeah, that gun. Very guys are giving me ammunition for probably the worst gun to go against at the moment. We're going back to the beginning. Reminds me a little bit of the grab orb from Half-Life 2. Should be in the clear now. Okay, team, that's everyone. Let's get out of here. Activate the pattern enhancers. I've got the ISO DC. took the isodesium. Oh no. And the lieutenant. Oh my god. He's dead. Monroe to Voyager. Four to beam back. Oh Borg time. Later, but Odell. Aim the wounded directly to sick bay. Where is Lieutenant Foster? Would you mind explaining exactly what happened? It, it was the Borg, sir. When we activated the pattern enhancers, they must have been able to beam in. They took Foster and the Isodesium. They caught us completely by surprise. They were in and out before we could even react. Ms. Murphy, you are dismissed. Could you not have prevented the Borg from taking the Isodesium? Sir, I didn't want to take the chance I might hit Foster. That is a chance you should have taken, Mr. Monroe. What? There is such a thing as acceptable losses. Had you fired, it is likely that the Borg would not have the Isodesium we need. And Foster might be dead. Possibly. 
but your emotional decision may have cost the lives of every member of this crew. Perhaps next time, you will consider this. Prepare a full report. I will summon you when we determine what action to take. Vulcan's emotionalists, they are. I just don't believe there was nothing they could do. Sir. Am I interrupting something? Shall I speak freely? Go ahead. Honestly, Monroe, I don't know how I could have gone so poorly. Ken, Foster, Odell, and we lost the Isodesium. What are you trying to say? I'm saying someone must be to blame. That's all. Hey, Monroe. I heard Odell's gonna make it. The doc says he got to him just in time. Oh, okay. Good thing you found him. They want to blame me now. Um, yeah, let's... Actually, not yet. Let's check the locker room. The armory, whatever you want to call it. Yeah. Oh, man, this sucks! This wasn't supposed to happen. How'd the board get here? Rick, relax. Relax? Relax? Those Borg killed Ken. I'm gonna go over there and personally break every one of their grimy necks with my own bare hands. Hey, Monroe. We're going over there, right? We gotta teach them not to mess with Starfleet. For Ken! Rick, look. We can't just go over to a Borg ship for revenge. Y yeah Well, what about Foster, huh? He might still be alive. We gotta save him. Probably assimilated them already. Don't say that, man! We can get him. We're a professionally trained hazard team. We'll get him back and give him some for Ken. Yeah. So I take Ken and him were friends, and now he's just looking at Ken's locker. I need to see the medic, because I am actually hurting. I guess I'm not seeing the medic, even though I'm hurting. Monroe, I've been working on 7 Zymon. It's coming along. Should be ready for field use pretty soon. That's good, we'll probably need it. Access the weapon that will actually work against the Borg. Excuse me. What? <sighs> hey, what else am I supposed to do? There's just nothing here. Teleporter, locker room. Excuse me. Alex, look, if you're blaming yourself, don't. None of us saw it coming. We couldn't have done anything. I know. Excuse me. I don't know what we were thinking. We, we weren't ready for this. This is crazy. We're dead in space. We're, we're not going to make it out of here. Crewman, get a hold of yourself. We'll make it. You say so, Monroe. Rick. Don't talk to me, Monroe. I'm wound up. I'm a quantum torpedo ready to blow, man. Maybe you should go to the holodeck and blow off some steam, Rick. Tuvok yeah. to Monroe. I'm Report to Astrometrics all immediately. Alright, then go to deck A. Is a possibility. You may well have the chance to find out. What? Though 
but goes against my better judgment. You are next in line for command of the hazard team. We are going to infiltrate the Boar Cube. Ensign? I take it you know Seven and Ensign Kim. Seven and I were going over the Ethereum's data, and we've located a Borg cube here in the dampening field with us. The vessel appears to be heavily damaged. Monroe, you and the Hazard team are going to beam over there and get back the Isodesium. And Foster? Ensign, we're not even sure he's still alive, but if it's possible to rescue him, then yes, by all means. But the Isodesium is of the highest priority. Seven will be joining you on this mission, and Ensign... You are now officially in command of the Hazard Team. Yes, sir. Seven has prepared a plan of action. Since we don't know where the Borg may be storing the Isodesia, I've chosen a beam-in point within reasonable proximity to a primary sub-processing matrix. From there, I should be able to determine the exact location of the Isodesia. Why not beam directly to the matrix? We do not wish to alert the Borg. The beam-in point is in an area of low importance. There is also an assimilation chamber en route. It is possible that Lieutenant Foster is as yet unassimilated and being held there. Hopefully, they'll be too busy repairing their ship to worry about a few trespassers. Sounds good. Get in there. Get the Isodesium. And rescue Foster if you can. Yes, Captain. I will join you and your team in the transporter room. Mr. Monroe, I trust your performance will surpass your previous efforts. <laughs> he's, he's sliding away, those Vulcans. <laughs> Once we have the Isodesium, we beam straight back here. Any questions? Yeah. Why aren't I on this mission? If we're gonna give the Borg some payback, you're gonna need some extra manpower. This isn't a revenge mission, Rick. Our mission is to get the Isodesium back. And rescue Foster. If possible, yes. As for firepower, Seven's Infinity Modulator prototype is ready for field testing. If the Borg turn nasty, It is unwise to underestimate the Borg. Yeah, see? You're gonna need me to help eliminate some Borg. God, uh, no offense, man. None taken. Beesman, I know you're upset about Ken and Foster, but killing a bunch of Borg isn't gonna bring them back. I need cool heads. You're gonna have to learn to control yourself before I can assign you to another mission. Dismissed. Monroe, come on. I said dismissed. Oh, you're loving this, aren't you? If there are no further delays, can I save it first? No? Okay, I guess we're going right in it. Once we land, I'll probably save and end it there. time we'll do this Let's see where it goes I think I'm doing pretty alright in this game and I am enjoying it now I also have the second one on GOG I'm playing these on GOG by the way I have to make a note to edit out the flashing sides of the screen I'll have to remember that but I'll see you next time and bye oh, let's exit the program logging off L cars menu system